This is an ending no one expected. Kiesia was supposed to get her license this week. She was supposed to cheer her first varsity game this year, but now her family is planning a funeral. She had a smile that would brighten up the whole room. Three Burger King coworkers stand in disbelief. She was smart and outgoing, and she was a good friend to have. That good friend to have was Kiesia Atkins. Thursday morning, Dinwiddie investigators say they found the 17-year-old's body in a wooded area behind her Century Hill Court home. Kiesia was reported missing when she didn't show up for cheer practice on Monday. I actually worked for her Monday, that Monday. She told me that she had to go to cheer practice, so she asked me could I come in for her, and I said yeah. For days, her family held out hope that Dinwiddie High School Rising Junior would come home alive. The family had hope up until the very last minute. But by Thursday afternoon, the news hit this tight-knit community hard. Police found her body and made an arrest. Officers charged 21-year-old Anton Deontay Coleman of Dinwiddie County with Kiesia's abduction. The family spokesperson says the family is grieving. The family needs your prayers more than anything to help them get through this situation. She's a beautiful girl and she will be well missed because she was well loved. Well, at this hour, detectives have not released what they believe led up to this suspicious death. Our sources do confirm that Coleman and Kiesia are related to each other. That suspect is sitting in a jail cell without bond. He's due in court on July 